Hey folks, Jay here. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to take down some more trees that are behind our garden patch. Let me show you the issue that arose and how we're going to take care of it. So yeah, we're going to cut a couple trees down today. So stick around. We're going to run the saw. It's been a little bit since we ran the saw. It's been hot, but it's been it's pretty cool today. Uh, low humidity. The humidity has been killing us here. So anyways, um, without further ado, folks, we're going to run the saw today and have some fun. So let's take down a couple trees to show you what's going All on. Right, folks, so this is our garden area. As you can see, this is our corn patch. Um, I hope everybody had a great July 4th. We were gone for about three four days did no videos it was really nice it took some time off but full sun as you can see already it what time is it now it is um it's approximately nine o'clock and nine o'clock and as you can see these are all still being shadowed if we come over here and look when we opened up this canopy here i wasn't sure how the sun was going to move and travel during the course of the day but as you can see here there's no real good sunlight on any of these and if we look up here these two trees here are shadowing the sun. So we're gonna take down these two trees. These are maples, these are small. I don't know if we'll actually get them out of here. Uh, this whole area is going to be cleared for a future project, which I'll go over at a later date. But yeah, today we're gonna to take down these two trees here to open up some sunlight to come in. So we're not shadowing our garden boxes here anymore. This whole area is gonna be rearranged. I'm probably gonna put our garden boxes here against the fence come next year, but for now, they're, they're doing fine here. As you can see, they're doing fantastic. All right, folks, you bring you up to speed here. That's our garden patch here. This section of leaves here, it get, when the sun comes out uh, in the evening, it shadows the whole area. Plus, driving through here with the tractor and the cars and the dump trucks, the dump trucks have been getting hung up on here. So we're gonna do some lemon before we make it to those uh, other trees here. We have our homemade safety pallet. OSHA would not approve, but we'll, uh, we'll make it work. Well, I think that looks a heck of a lot better. As you can see here, the sun rises directly up and over us, so that should be nice. That was quite the branch. All right, we got the McCulloch out, cutting up those couple big branches. Look at this fine load of crap. We're gonna go out in the woods. Right, folks, let's it. give you an update here. Here's our corn patch. Look how good that looks. What do you think, Dad? It's coming up nice. 
these are all our vegetable boxes what I want to do this is the first I mentioned it um, maybe I mentioned it before I'm not sure all this area where that stump is that giant tree I want to clear and level this all to grade and go from pretty much the corner of this uh, garden the corn patch all the way over to there this is just as you can see overgrown there's nothing to it we're gonna take down these two trees right here it's a little windy for my liking but again we're just gonna drop them and worry about them later but I want to clear this and have this all be usable garden space directly this way is 87 degrees east so the Sun rises up here and gets full Sun literally down here especially with what we just limbed this area will get full Sun all day so that's coming up in the future in the fall probably but for today let's go ahead and take down these two trees here out here is gonna be the hardest part yeah. getting out there is the hardest part this is all just overgrown yeah, I can walk right over the pile. That's what I'm doing. Yeah. Dad's here, if you guys are wondering. I don't do any tree work without a second person here. God forbid if there was any injury. Yeah, all in here is still solid ground. This is all just wasted space. You can literally clear all this, bring this up with some grade, with some dirt, and uh, we, should, we should be good to roll. So. As you can see, this is overgrown, wasted area. I think, to get an idea, this one should go into the abyss and we could skid it out later. I'm wondering if I should take out that one first. Both gotta go, they both eclipse in the uh, garden beds. So we're in the thicket. Let me just show you, this is so overgrown this whole area overgrown really bad let's go ahead and limb some of these give us some room and then we'll send this bad Larry on its way and we'll chain it and we'll skid it out with the excavator uh, in the fall <laughs> This way so we're gonna go ahead and send it that way So that's down we're safe we got it right where we want it it's out of the way we can reach it when we get the excavator now let's take this one down here drop it back probably this way so let's venture through the thicket again this is what we're dealing with this is what a lot of the property is saplings and overgrown it's brutal now I'm on this one here you still down here I guess not all right, let's clean this up a little bit. This is nuts.
Let there be light. All right, folks, so dad's over there supervising. Um, again, we're just gonna leave these here. They're off the ground, they're not gonna rot. Trust me, we'll use the wood. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and head back up where he is and then um, let's take a look at it from there. All right, perfect. You can hardly tell we took out a couple more, but I wanted to give you guys an idea. Sorry, I'm out of breath of what's coming. All this from this corner all the way out to that stump, from that stump, all the way over to there. I want it all cleared and leveled to grade, fit a ton of room out here for uh, more garden space. I'm getting pretty serious about this whole homesteading thing. Maybe put some chickens back there out of the way. Dad and I will do another. You up for more fencing, Dad, or what? Oh, yeah. yeah, it was easy. Uh, the post was the hardest part. So yeah, that's enough for today, folks. As you can see, tree, 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 tree. The sun rises up this way, so we're clearing to make room for our garden, so. Thanks for watching guys. Let me know what you think. Um, we just cleared the uh, trees as you saw for the early sun and then the beginning of the video we limbed those trees so the late sun could get in down here. So we should have full, full sun now. Um, this whole garden thing was new this year so determining and following the sun during the course of the year, uh, during the course of the season, uh, is what I need to do in order to make amends. Because as you can see now, no issues at all, full sun. Uh, it's just, I wanna get the sun down here as early as possible and we're surrounded by trees here. So we're making it work. Thanks for watching guys. God bless, let me know what you think and we will see you out in the woods. I'd like to thank Pops for coming down to supervise and help me lift it, uh, lifting me up on the tractor there on our OSHA approved um, <laughs> front lift there. So thanks for watching guys, let me know what you think. And like I always say, we will see you out in the woods.